Great finds today. I got in a Transformer Voltron lot, and I'm going to need your help. Great finds today. I got in a whole lot of different Transformers. I have a Voltron. I have some things I can't identify, and I got a whole just bunch of stuff that I'm really going to need your help on. Now, these came out in the 80s. They were very cool out of Japan. There's different ones. And the problem is that since Transformers became very popular, different companies came out with ones. And there's a lot of different sort of Transformer-esque things. And I just don't know because I'm not an expert in it. Now, I do know this is Voltron. The Legend of Voltron. Voltron, this is actually just a flashlight. You can see where the flashlight, the bulb would go in there. You have his batteries to go in there. And he would show you the way to wherever he was going. Now, Transformers are very cool. They transform into different things. Unfortunately, I am not as well versed in Transformers. And you almost need an engineering degree to get these things into what they are. So I don't even know what these things transform into. Uh, I do have two planes. I have two planes here. You can see the Transformer sticker on the front here. These are cool planes. You can see that they do stand up and they would do what, whatever they transform into. Some, well, uh, some sort of robot. And then there's also something called like Dinobots. Will you get to the point? Autobots meet Dinobots. Which also transform into animals. And this is a crocodile. It's a crocodile. I can tell that much. You can see there that he would. he's pretty cool. He does transform. I'm sure he does. There's his legs. But I, I, I don't know how to do it. You can see when they were made. You can see this is made in Japan in 87. So this, this one will be easier to look up. Now, I personally, if I was going to be a transformer, I wouldn't want to transform into a crocodile. I would think maybe a jet or a car or something. But that's just me. I think that would be cooler. I'm not sure that's... I could really get away from this. I would have to swim or... These don't run very fast. So these planes, I got two of these planes... They're very cool. They're very well made. They're very hard to transform. Now this guy, I wouldn't know what he transforms into. But because he's already transformed into the robot himself. He does have his stickers. Almost looks like a Lego piece there. But you can find what they are from here. It's They, they have tiny heads. He has a tiny head. Now these, I got two of these little guys. And I was able to figure out these because these are very simple this it transforms into some sort of car you can see you in you back them up and he drives i think he's supposed to pop up and he pops up into this guy he pops up into this guy and he can do whatever he's got to do he's got a little lever i don't know what the lever does i don't know if the lever's for the other thing it is it is kind of interesting this one I was able to figure out. This is from 87. This is a two-headed beast monster. A two-headed transformer. He's got little fins on here. I don't know what exactly. If he's a dinosaur, Dinobots. He's got tiny feet. I don't know what he transforms into. But this, this one's easy to figure out. And I know he can go for some pretty good money. This is... this. Now, I would also like to transform into a truck. I think that'd be cool. The trucks are cool. This guy, he's almost close. You can see his head there. I almost feel like I'm going to break these things if I if I really... Well, this one's a little bit easier. There he is with his, his tiny head. And I don't know if he's a Dodge. They usually are American cars. The big three can transform into whatever they may be. So there he is. He's, he's really cool. A little kind of cool car. This looks like some sort of rocket ship. Not sure what he does exactly. These are these are really tough, and that's why I need your help. Because I need your help because I don't know whether to sell these as a lot, which I'll probably do. But they're cool. They're 80s. They're vintage. They're awesome. This looks like it's missing whatever's supposed to go in here. Because this almost looks like some sort of transport vehicle. It's got little wheels on them. 
So there's that guy there. Now these, I got this big lot thing here, and there's there's just a bunch of pieces. I don't know if there's transformer pieces. I do know that these are going to be worth more if they have all the parts. It is very big difference in price. Here's another plane. Plane. He's got. He. This one has metal wheels. These are well-made vehicles. There's a. He's got a little bit better feet, so I can get this guy to stand up. I'm sure he comes down. I don't know if his head's missing, where it is, but that's that's a different plane. This looks like a similar one we have here. I don't know, maybe, maybe, I, I just don't know. This is really why I need your help. And this looks like another one, another plane. This doesn't feel as well made as the other ones, so it might be a knockoff, but he does have the metal wheel. Looks like a, another little jumping kind of transformer little guy. Where's this? Where's his head? I don't know. But there he is. This guy. There's, a, of course, another plane. I have three of these planes here. This, I'm not sure, is a transformer. No clue. Definitely not a transformer. Ooh, this is a transformer. Pencil sharpener. Hey, if you need your pencil sharpened, this is what you can do. And these guns. These are the hard ones to figure out, where the guns go. If you can figure out who the gun's for, these are probably the things that are worth the most money because people lost these. They're little tiny pieces. Oh, looks like some sort of hat. Le it actually looks like Lego. There's a gun. Almost looks like a G.I. Joe. Oh, I've got, I've got a leg. I've got some other parts here. I've got another leg. A head. It's almost like there was a transformer autopsy I got, a, I got some more i got another arm i don't know where his body is he's got two heads i don't know if he's two same guy no different guy not very nice looking kind of like a steve austin maybe we can rebuild him gentlemen we can rebuild him some parts to a plane a ladder not sure what it oh here's boba fett well if you like the mandalorian this is boba fett now, this is Star Wars, of course, and if you got this thing to shoot out, it'd be worth a lot of money. And it looks like he's missing his hands. He probably has a little trouble eating, but how do Mandalorians eat anyway? They, they got this big helmet on here. I don't know, it's kind of cool. Got some different things. There's a leg. That's probably a G.I. Joe. Some Legos. Another little gun. It's the same gun. I don't think Transformers use crossbows. I'm not quite sure. There's one shoe, Cinderella. This That might be to the other guy, too. This is... Now, this guy doesn't have any markings. He's He might be one of the just a knockoff toy. Not too exciting. He doesn't look... Now, this is awesome. I don't know what this is. But it's cool. It looks some sort of helicopter-esque thing. Another rocket... No idea whatsoever. Anyway, this is a bazooka. I don't think they use bazookas either. This looks like the back of something. Oh, Michael Jackson must have been there. Nice. Here's another Transformer. And I think this, this is a little bit different. This is from Lannard. It's from 1984. He does, he's, well, it's a Corvette. Transforms into something. I don't know. I'm also I'm almost afraid to break. The, these seem like they could easily, because you can't force. I don't want to force anything, because you don't want to break these. But that that that's a pretty cool thing. A spider, not a transformer. This some sort of ray gun. Oh, there's a little person. Hey, how'd you get in there? Anyway, Legos. This looks like a junk drawer of stuff. But I really I. I'm afraid to put these up because I... Another leg. I don't know what these... There's... That's a, that's a cool... It looks like it might shoot out in some way. There's two of those. So if we can figure out what those are, those are awesome. There's some sort of bumblebee. Another rocket. The guns. The guns. There's tons and tons of guns. I don't know why that has that particular price on it. But that's a cool thing. Oh, there's another arm. 
I think put that to Steve Austin. No clue. And shoes. There's just a, a variety of shoes. Oh, this is I think this is a hand. It's a punching hand. Transforming. What's this? Now this is a transformer hand because they all have those those fists. Probably goes on one of these things here. Not sure what this one. This one has a 21, whatever that means. This would probably be easier to identify because of its P38. That's a cool thing. More shoes. I don't know what this thing is. Venom. Nothing. Anyway, I really could use your help on these kind of things. These things are very cool. I know Transformers are very collectible. I know Voltron. If he had his light and he works, he's gonna be he's gonna be nice. Two headed, two headed, two heads are better than one. I'd like to thank you for watching. Thank you for looking. I appreciate any comments down below so I can figure out what I have here. And if you want to write it down and you have a pencil and you need a pencil sharpener, I'll send you one of these.